Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Fable 2 uh, walkthrough. Yeah, I actually just uh, came here after my first episode, so yeah, it should uh, she should be talking once I press the A button. So yeah, let's get this started. Ah, there you are, and your faithful friend too. Many years ago, I promised I would help you avenge your sister's death. That day has come. Today. You leave the safety of this camp and seek out Lucian. The journey will not be easy. There's a chest near your camp. Alrighty then, let's go to my chest. Yeah guys, uh, I hope you guys are enjoying, uh, enjoying the content I'm putting out. But yeah, uh, let's uh, let's look at the start drive. Tired of life. Wait, I gotta do this in every episode I can. Kick the shit out your chicken. Kick the shit out your chicken. Alrighty, let's <laughs> open my chest here. <clears throat> Alright, yep, take rusty sword and take the splinter crossbow, a couple health pots. My dog elixir. Alrighty, let's let's get this started. Get the fuck up, fuck up out of here. Let's go. Now come with me. Open the gate. B -b bitch, move. Oh, that really, nigga. Come on. Take this. Alrighty. It is a powerful artifact, the kind of which all heroes once. What came. is she doing? It will grant you access to places others cannot go. It will also allow me to talk to you when necessary. Now, look down towards the left. The seal will allow you to enter that tomb. In its darkest depths lies the chamber of fate. When you come out again, you will be stronger, much stronger. Alrighty. Slow motion walk to the end, isn't it? Alright, swag. Uh, let's get. I stop down here. You, probably the easy way to get down here. Right? We. And you get your first treasure chest as soon as you get down from here, which is right here. You might get like a jewel, I believe. Oh, you get you get a health potion. Alrighty. Yeah, it's always different. So, Let's swim across this. There's also a silver key, which are used to open up the big the big chest. The more you collect, the more chests you can open. So, yeah, here's one back here. I believe there's a digging spot uh, for the dog. I don't exactly remember. I think it's like somewhere out here. I have to wait for him to get over here, though. Come on, doggy. Hurry your ass up now. I guess this is like really nice graphics for the the time being it came out. Now you have other great games. All right, come on, doggy, come on, come on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Is there a digging spot here, doggy? Is there a digging spot? And okay, no, no digging spot. He's a wait for me. Okay, good doggy. Now let's unlock this. I'm gonna be trying to go like mostly ranged because range is probably like the best you can go here. You can like decapitate most guys. You can. It's really easy uh, for us. For Will, not really. Like the only Will I'm really gonna be leveling up is uh, uh, what is it? Uh, to resurrect like fallen. You basically summon ghosts to help you uh, fight. They're really useful. Don't be alarmed. I'm speaking to you through the guild. And I. You will need to bah. jump into that hole to continue. Alrighty, Don't there's worry. is a the water at the bottom will break. There is a pocket over here somewhere. Which you can dive uh I believe I think so. It's this one, uh, so yeah, okay, was it this one? Alrighty, let's let's, let's let's get it on. And shit's in us. Uh yep, there you go. Giant beetles. Let's get this on. Let's get it on. Let me just. 
There we go. Now, if you want to absorb these little orbs right here. Oh, crap. Oh, fuck. Ow! You want to absorb these little orbs, all you have to do is hit the RT, the right trigger, and then it should absorb uh, it farther. So you'll get more experience based off the weapon you use to kill the, uh, the, your enemies. You'll get more experience for that. For example, I have, uh, the yellow is yellow is the range, the red is uh, melee, and then the blue is mana. So if you kill, if you kill, if you use like different combos, then uh, you'll get a variety. As for me, I'm mostly using range because that's really what I want to level up as soon as I can. There you go. And, uh, God, let's see. Alrighty. Yes. And the green is overall. Yeah. The knowledge and experience of the creatures that you kill. Okay, there's a chest over here. Yep. I don't remember exactly what this one has. I think it's either jewel or more potions. It's a, I believe it's a jewel though. Nope, more potions. Yeah, I'm really bad at telling what comes out of these fucking chests. You'll have to shoot this. Okay. Yep. And uh, there you go. Those will pop up every now and then for like puzzles and stuff like that, but they're, they're pretty simple. This blue means blue means magic. Uh, yellow means range, and red means melee. All right then. Oh, come on. Alrighty, I'll just absorb all this. Let's continue. Oh, fuck, I thought there was something there. No? Alrighty, let's just swim. Uh, this area? No. Alright, this... So the area if you get to the side you can search for the uh, carry stuff. Uh, I'll read those later. I don't know if you guys are really interested in those. They sometimes they carry uh, like quick. Okay. Uh, here we go. Items. Uh, the first note. So I had this. It appears a page from Explorer recording uh, details of expedition to the cave. Third day, my hands are shaking from exhaustion. I must remain vigilant. Almost. Not off last night, I camped around the fire, but still managed to keep my eye on. Oh crap, I'm sorry, keep my eye on Eric and Drake. I've seen the greedy glimmer of their eyes. They mean they mean to take the treasure of theirs. Perhaps it's time to make use of the poison right in. So, yeah, I guess three friends came in here looking for some treasure, and they're all, they're all very hesitant. They're all not trustworthy of each other. Oh, wait, oh, there's another. Search him. Okay. There's another one. That was written as a member of the expedition. Dearest Harriet, our voyage and trails of the Bower Lake has taken its turn for the worse. I only hope I survive daylight again. You are right about, about Bre Brendan and Drake. They are selfish brutes conspiring behind my back, plotting a murder so they can keep the treasure for themselves. But fear not, my love, I plan to poison their water supplies. While I while they sleep, soon I shall be rich. Feverishly yours, forever alpha. Yeah, feverishly yours, Eric. Feverishly yours. Fuck, kind of. Uh, whatever. Ready? <clears throat> Excuse me. And let's see. I believe there's one more corpse over on here. Feverishly, huh? Never heard that one before. But oh, well, all right. And shoot you out. Uh, Roof. Alrighty. I'll probably use my melee, but like later, right now, range is working for me, so it's not the big of a deal. Uh, I don't remember. I think there's something around here. Where's my dog? Is there anything doggy? No. Okay. Alrighty. Yep, and I level up. I believe. I believe I level up in the range, so. Alright, just keep killing them from a distance. Alright, oh fuck, I keep missing. Shit. Come on, fucking hit him. There you go. I will be personally Fallout 3 soon, so yeah, you can expect a, a playthrough of that. And that'll be, it's probably, like I said, it's one of my favorite games. I, I, 
I think I misplaced it someplace. Alright, let's put this here. Put this here, and uh, there you go. Come on, come on, there you go. Uh, like I said, I, seem to, I think I misplaced it somewhere, so uh, so I don't have it anymore, so I don't have to repurchase it. And uh, yeah, I'm probably doing a playthrough of that sometime soon. Alright, hey, let's go through these doors. I think I missed a part, to be honest. Oh, nope, it's right here. Alrighty. It has a chest and it has quite a bit of books in there. It has, it has a lot of stuff. Right. Creepy noises, though. Kind of give you that creepy vibe. Uh, okay. Alright. I'm gonna just destroy some shit here. Because there's a chest. Alright, let's search in here. Of course there's treasure. Oh, there's a hundred gold already. And there's another treasure chest over here. Just destroy these boxes. Right here. Here we go. There we go. More, more gold already. Uh, let's, I guess. I'll just take them. You guys can press pause at any moment just to read all this stuff. I'm just going to... Uh, cause I've already read most of this, so. Okay. Alright, let's keep on going. Alrighty. We're almost out, too, so. Yep, here we go. Beyond these broken doors lies the Heroes Guild. For centuries, this academy trained the most supremely gifted sons and daughters of Albion, bound together by the blood that flowed in their veins. Once worshipped by the people of Albion, the great heroes came to be feared and hated. Your blood is awakening. Oh, Hulk status! I'm just kidding. You can now channel the experience you have collected into strength, skill, or will. Strength improves combat with hand-to-hand -hand weapons. Skill allows you to shoot faster and with greater accuracy. Will gives you control over the forces of magic. Before you is a color's gate. It reacts to the will of one who seeks to use it. You have not been able to use will yet, but the simple act of reaching this place has given you will experience. You need to learn a will ability to activate the color's gate. And for the sake of this, I will... Now use the knowledge you yep. have gained so far to better yourself of this, in I strength, have... skill, and... I guess I'll just learn, like... I guess I'll learn shock, for the, just for the sake of it. And then my skill. Yeah, I can now, uh... Dext well, I mean, I can... Excellent. Can you feel the power yep. coursing through you? And just shoot that right there. Oh. Well done. Now All right, let's get out of here. Begin your journey. Use the color skate. Click and hold the right stick to get a good look. Use your newfound abilities to defeat. <laughs> Alright, that's enough of that. Let me just, uh... Come on. There we go. Yep. Collect the experience orbs. Make your way to Bowerstone. I will meet you there. You could just jump off of here, too. Just here. Yeah. Those green orbs hold the knowledge and experience of the creatures that you kill. It's dark as fuck, too. Alright, let's travel to Bowerstone. Funny, because I played the first one and everything looks so different. I guess that's what they're trying to do, because I think it's, it's a couple years after. Because Teresa, if, uh, spoiler alert, so you guys can skip a couple, like a minute ahead, spoiler alert. Teresa is actually your sister in the first one, so. So, yeah, if you, uh. Because uh, she gets her eyes gouged out, and uh, that's why she's like, "Oh, I can see her eyes are bad." So yeah, you have to go. That's basically the first game. You have to go save your sister from the bandits, and that's the uh, 
Later in the game, you'll, you'll uh, we'll see the old uh, where the first one takes place. Right. Apologies, citizen. The road to Bearstone is closed due to the bandit activity. I'm afraid that as long as the bandit thag is alive, the road stays closed. If you're in an hurry, like, you can always take care of thag yourself. And that's what I'm going to do. So, the road to Bowerstone is closed. It would seem Thag has been capturing traders on their way to the Bower Lake camp. He is a danger to all and must be dealt with. With your new power, you should be able to defeat him and his gang and continue your quest. No doubt they are at his camp near Bower Lake. Keep your wits about you. It may be a that trap. That is a trap. Look out! It's an ambush! Yep, and let's carry all this. Just kind of comboed off a bit back and forth. Alright, let's use something different. And, uh, yeah, alright. More bandits. Alright, let's, let's use our melee weapon. We haven't used that one. Alright, let's uh, whip that ass a bit. Alright, let's, uh, let's. Kind of get, get this, this field going. Let's kind of get this uh, ready. Let's uh, all right, and just kind of keep shooting them back and forth. And now, there we go. Don't do it, doggy. He gets fucking dropped too. Look, bow. You kick my fucking dog. I'll gut you myself. I'll give you three seconds to get ready. No way, two. Oh, sorry. No! Yo, creepy ass nigga. Alright, let's get rid of you here. Let's kind of spam this a bit. Kind of. Alright, do that. Wait until he starts, uh. There we go. Just kind of move out the way. I just keep kind of abusing that. Fuck, I keep breaking. Alrighty. I am gonna try to kill him with my, uh, my arrow, though. So I'm just gonna. There we go. Alrighty. So that was pretty easy. That's probably the most simple boss you'll have in this game. I will tell the gods of Thag's death. Alrighty. And with let me, uh. Removed, the road doggy! To can doggy! Uh, heal. Heal. Here we go. Heal. Come on. Thag keeps the key to the cage in his hut. Alrighty. Let's open up this chest and get the key so we can save these poor uh, slaves. Yep, that's key. Some some jerky, some money, more money. It's always good. Uh, let's uh, let's actually rest a couple of hours. It will say twelve hours so uh, to the daytime. Alrighty, sounds good. And uh, wait, oh, I forgot there was money right here. Yep. Oh. Oh, a single gold. Oh. Oi, mate. Our troubles are ah, no one cares. Those yeah, to yeah, yeah. I paid for them. Yeah, you paid for them, but guess what? No longer. <gasps> Fuck you. Thank you so much. I can't believe you Fuck did you that. gonna do about it, homie? We're free. Free to wander the paths and byways of the land. No Alrighty. monster but the wind itself. Time stretched out before is like, I like, what's the word I want, Reg? I don't know, and it's Regina. Right, I'm going now. Uh, thanks again. Oh uh, yes, thanks. Dan, you just turned down hard cash. They will never forget your kindness. What are you gonna do? I think he does try to attack You're me. A nutter, you know that. A nutter. Yep. You're the dung eater who killed. And dead. Oh no, I forgot. Alright. Damn, this thing is eating everything. Alrighty. There we go. And, uh. Yep. Uh. Yep. Let's, uh. Let's 
Oh, speed, okay. The greater your speed, the fast The faster I'll do this. Yeah, yeah, I know. Alrighty. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, let's go. Let's go back to Bowerstone. So it should be open now, and we're gonna see quite a bit of people just walking in. There's another chest over here in case you guys are curious. Right here. I believe this one. I, I don't remember exactly. I think this one carries the bandits, or it's the one, uh, the second chest I will find. Oh, yeah, the assassin's cloak. Let me put that on because it looks fucking schmexy. I'll have that on for a while. Uh, here we go, assassin's cloak. Alrighty. Alright, let's get let's get it on over here. Alright. I wish I would have done more with the with the clothes customization too, and then make your character look like look all weird looking when he had his when he has his clothes on. Alrighty, let's get back to to the entrance and get to Bower uh Bower Lake I guess. Bowerstone. Yep, people are walking in. Hello people move the fuck out the way. During certain scenes, you can make comments using the D-pad. Up is the positive comments, down is the negative comments. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, let's, uh... Yeah, th th this nigga's gonna try to sing for me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Move the fuck out the way, please. Leave me alone. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Leave me alone. I, I, I sorry, I really don't like that guy. That's all I've got so far. But maybe if I walk around Bowerstone with you, I'll get some inspiration. The only guy I ever wanted to kill in this game, like, like seriously kill. The only pedestrian I better yet. Bad news. I'm afraid I will be delayed for a while. In the meantime, you should buy some new equipment and prepare for the challenges ahead. But you'll need money. If you need money, there are jobs to be found. I believe the blacksmith has an opening. Alrighty, uh, let's uh, let's do this for a bit. The noble blacksmith. Oh, stop. Alrighty, this is probably the most simple job out there until the. Good blow. Yep, and just keep doing this. Oh crap! This is how you, I guess you make your money in this game. And yep, four gold. Whew. Oh, moving up in the world. Nice hit. Hmm. All right, gold, and it just—it kind of just multiplies itself. And it just keeps going up and up and up, and then... that's how you make your money in this game. Uh, I believe the woodcutter is probably the easiest next to this one. But this one's probably just easier. It's just, you just gotta have a fast eye for this kind of stuff. Just, just uh, if you guys want to actually skip the these, you guys can just skip That's like a couple minutes ahead. Probably like maybe two minutes. Uh, it should be uh, done over with. I'm just gonna buy a new gun and not a new uh, new melee weapon. I just keep doing this. A good strike. I just keep doing this. There we go. And now we can. Uh, well, it should be able to buy our gun now. Yep. Yeah, we can just save it real quick. Alrighty. Have I told you how I became a bar? <laughs> it's quite a funny story, really. Don't care. Uh. How much is it for this one? Shit, Devin. This is the one I want. Oh shit. I guess I guess I'm about to continue. I saw this loot in a shop and I bought it. Amazing, isn't it? All right, here we go. I'm going to continue a bit until I get uh until I have enough money to get that rifle. Keep hitting it like All that. Right. Just keep doing this. I should I should have enough by the end of this one, which is actually pretty fast uh We'll just keep a perfect oh, fuck me. 
Oh shit. Oh that I fucked that up. So I need eleven hundred, which is uh quite a bit away. And I just keep doing this, keep hacking away. Shaping up nicely. Funny story actually uh how I bought this game. I had actually um so what had happened was that so all so I guess on, it was on Easter a couple of years ago, probably 2009. This game was, I believe this game was fairly new. I bought it because I bought it for $60, so it must have been new. Um, I went home one morning, one night, better yet. Uh, I went home from Easter. As soon as I got home, my, my window was open and all. This is, they, they took a lot of my stuff. Like, what made me mad is that they took my hard drive, my controllers, and all my games. They left me the Xbox and the, cab the cables to the back. That was literally that's all they left me. It was the the most the most awkwardest thing ever. I I didn't even know what to feel. To tell you the truth, I kind of felt mad. At but I was like, why would you leave me? Why don't you just take the whole thing? You know, just why leave me with this? But I was like, whatever. Okay, so I had gotten money that uh, I was a freshman. I had gotten quite a bit of money from my dad to buy like clothes and stuff like that, and I had quite a bit of money left over. So what I ended up doing is I ended up buying a new hard drive, a 20 gig hard drive. Uh, a new controller and f this game, this, like, the first game I actually I bought, uh, and I was and actually and I this is how I started playing Fable and I played the hell out of this game. I probably might have done like a couple playthroughs of this game because, like I said, it's one of my favorite games. Oh fuck me, one of my favorite games of all time. Just because due to the fact that it, it just I don't know why it just made me it, like this game made me feel so happy. I don't know, just probably the the kind of uh, tone it had. Yeah, but I can if uh, if they did like a remaster of this for the Xbox One, I would totally buy it. But I doubt they're gonna do that. I don't, well, maybe there's a possibility because they it seems like they're remastering all the games. They're remastering they remastered Halo because it was such a huge franchise. They remastered. Uh, they're going to I believe they're going to remaster the Gears of War uh, Gears of War trilogy. Judgment does not count. All right, I have enough. So. Uh, yeah, here's hoping they do that, and if they do, well, yeah, they always have me to. I'll buy the I'll buy the shit out the trilogy. I know they did the whole like you can buy all three for a certain amount. Alrighty, now I can buy this gun I want, flintlock. Alrighty, now I can just sell this. I can sell this shitty as weapon. How much was it? I forgot. Alrighty. I'm just not just waiting for Teresa. I am literally, I'm seriously debating killing this guy. Doesn't just tell people when it's time to go to bed, you know. Meet me by the clock tower in the main square. Oh, where you at? So any time you fancy a change of name, pay him a visit. I apologize for the delay. Events are moving quickly indeed. All right, guys. Before we begin, this will be actually the end of this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and don't forget to like my videos, comment if you want, and if if you like my overall channel for subscribe yeah i'll see you guys in the next episode and i'll talk to you guys later